There's no question Dungeness crab is a big deal in Oregon. In 2018 alone, they pumped an estimated $75 million into the economy, which is why researchers are paying close attention to a new study that for the first time ever showed acidic waters off the coast of Oregon and Washington are damaging the shells of baby crabs. Where you see that the shell is no longer intact, normal, and then, you know, it's it's basically dissolving away. Right? Nina Bednarsik was the lead author of the NOAA-funded study. On the individuals where we have found this extensive shell being dissolved away, we have also seen that those crabs were much smaller in comparison with the other intact crabs. When carbon dioxide is released into the atmosphere from the burning of fossil fuels, some scientists estimate as much as a third of it gets absorbed by the ocean. Once dissolved, the CO2 combines with the water and forms something called carbonic acid. It's that acid that researchers believe is dissolving the crab shells, as well as damaging important sensors the crabs need to find food. What this means for future Dungeness crab populations, the jury is still out. But scientists say these findings certainly raise concern. And there's all these other factors out in the wild, and so it's hard at the moment to say that ocean acidification is going to directly impact fishery yield, right? And that's what people are really concerned about. For years, researchers have been studying in the lab how acidic water is impacting these baby crabs. But this is actually the first time they've made this comparison, seen this relationship out in the oh, wow. field, meaning out in wow. the ocean, natural environment. Yeah, that's wild. I wonder if they'll be able to compare it to other regions of the ocean around the world right. and see if they're getting similar results. So what is next for the researchers? Well, they say they're going to be back out. They're going to be back out this spring. What's interesting, they're going to look at uh, how acidic water uh, impacts the baby crabs. But they're actually going to look at how both the acidic water and ocean hypoxia, which mm -hmm. we know is a lack of uh, oxygen in the water, mm -hmm. how both those combined impact the baby crabs. Well, interesting well. stuff. Keep us yeah. posted on their research as they go. Yeah, you yeah. bet. Really, Big thanks. deal Keep for it. Oregon's economy. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, sure is.